And also, I had a pet squid in my dream. Yep. There's always ah. a squid. <laughs> so, now what? Yeah, what am I supposed to do with that? <laughs> and once again, the day is saved. Thanks to... Power Pup! I'm back downstairs. So, like, as Akimoto comes down, he's holding Prism by the hair. He throws him to the ground. Pr poor Prism is just bleeding and beaten up as Akimoto just stands there and says, this is enough. You need to get off our ship. And then the ship begins to rumble. Everyone kind of looks outside, and you see exactly what I just described happen before you. Holy I Pikachu! I'm gonna, I'm gonna side with Akimoto on this one. I think we need to leave the ship that's within the, the, the space moving. <laughs> hey, while everybody's looking out the window, can I trade out? Uh, can I tell GBC to it back to um, or I wanna, I wanna sneak Hoopa out. Okay. So yeah, we should start like tell hooping out like the injured. Okay, that's not a bad idea. Uh, friendly, helpful Hoopa comes out and says hi. <laughs> Oh, I, I, I take it back. Just end the universe is now, please. <laughs> Hi, I'm friendly, helpful Hoopa. No, no, Hoopa! No, no. Yeah, there we go. No, quiet, we're in trouble. <laughs> no, if you don't want to die... Hey, we, if we don't want to die, just get us out of here. We're in that much trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. Why? It forms a portal behind you. Thank you. Everyone, if you have a red X on them, throw them in the portal. <laughs> <laughs> I get Appa to like quickly run around and scoop everybody in his tusks. Yeah, actually, I think they'll let you do that. Uh, Akimoto steps forward and says, "Our vi our vision is finally being fulfilled." A fixed universe here. He he actually kind of gently picks up Prism more so than you'd think, and he starts uh, like he's expecting someone to come pick him up. Lavi's gonna do that. Lavi's gonna. Okay, you're gonna go. Yeah, I think okay. he has to have this encounter with Akimoto, as he, he as he notices they're both in Lucario burst. <laughs> Akimoto just gently places Prism in your arms, and he says, you children are in way over your head. You mean well, but you're going to inter you're going to harm things more than help. Lavi is just going to have a fixated glare on Akimoto and not say anything, just turn and walk away with um, Prism, who he can't move. <laughs> you should be able to move him, I'm sorry. So are, is this Team Fresh Floof disengaging? Because they actually will allow that. Uh, I want out. <laughs> I don't think Lavi will leave because you will want to. You'll want to check on get the others out. But he's just getting. He's just moving Prism over to to get him away. We'll get Scarlet. Let's get the hell out of here. All right, yeah, could... he, Lavi's just gonna like throw Prism into the portal. I, I was just gonna say, what about Scarlet? Yeah. yeah. He looks at you and says, "You may go. I I will go with you to collect your friend." <laughs> okay. No offense, Akimoto. Why don't you sit my nuts? I'd rather not have you walking behind me. You want you want you go ahead. You lead the way. I'll follow you. I'll go with you, Lavi. <laughs> he he actually thinks for a moment and says we could and like this is one of the rare times he would actually kind of smile and joke. He says we can hold hands if you want. It's, it's a little weird, dude. But... Dude. I ship Wait, it. Is it. I not... ship it. I ship it. It's happening. That's now. a bit weird. I mean, are we not? We're technically birthed with the same Lucario here. This is weird. <laughs> <laughs> he uh, he just he just shrugs, and uh, you can hear Burb go, "Wow, that was his attempt at a joke. That that was terrible." Lavi Moto <laughs> shit for the win. Lavi Moto, no. shit, it's real. The uh, one by Sharp who's j and the Crobat who are just kind of caked in blood and water just walk away satisfied as uh, the Deoxys disengage you. Doctor Adier floats with them as well. Lavi's also going to quickly water bend some water and just throw it at Akiza just to kind of give her more water so maybe she's not dead. <laughs> Lana bends down and tries to give her first aid. She shouts, she's in serious condition. We're going to need to treat her right away. 
and uh, Xerneas picks her up, and they head outside the portal. Okay, let's go. Plaid comes over to Jade and says, uh, J- Miss Jade, I'm I- I've probably the best trained uh, medic here, aside from the the Aura Guardians, and uh, probably probably best trained aside from the Aura Guardians. I'm going to go with them. Okay. Uh, yeah, please do what you can to help. I appreciate it. And Amber, we're going to need all the help we can get. Would you come with us? She goes, sure. They gather up the Aura Guardians and they head out. Yeah, and Appa helps them too, so Appa's going with them. Cool. I'm basically just waiting at the portal with Hoopa so that till we get everybody through. That's all I'm doing. I want to go through with everybody else, but I'm like... Right. Making sure the little brat behaves. Uh, I'm going to give you control of Pelly K so that he can go with you. Okay. okay. They look at you and said, if you recall your Pokemon, we'll recall ours. Who's who's you? As in, they'll recall the Deoxys. Wait, who are you talking to? Akimoto's talking to Luna. So just not Battle Bond anymore? Yeah, essentially. What about Lunala? I don't have a Pokemon for <laughs> uh, Yeah, you, you do. Have- you have a Pokeball no. for Yeah, we've drawn a Lu- Lunara, because I don't want to know what they're going to do if they get their hands on Lunara. All right, Luna, you drop the Battle Bond. Uh, Akimoto is not dropping his Burst form, however, and neither are the Neither two. is Lamy. <laughs> they just kind of nod respectfully. <laughs> you guys step upstairs. All right, you lot walk upstairs. You see Venti holding three people captive. Hey, Venti. Oh, hey, how's it going? Good, we almost had it sussed, but a lot of people got hurt, so we're sending them all back. Oh, man, Wait. sorry to hear that. No one no one got dead, though, yeah? Uh, no one's dead as far as I know, but a lot of The Bisharp guy chuckles to himself and licks off some water from his claw. Right. You bastard! <laughs> oh, yeah, right. he may have killed it. He may have killed. We're not sure. She seems okay, but maybe not. I'm sure it's already a soul. You're on thin ice, random guy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I've taken these well, guys prisoner. If uh, any of you are good at uh, fully capturing people, now would be a good time. Uh, by the way, you three are awake. Finally. And you can interact uh, however you think. Monkey mm. buddy, you here? <laughs> oh, oh man. I was having the most wonderful dream. It didn't have world domination or anything it was just living a, a quiet life <laughs> with my lover asperger the ghost please let us go and we will never harm anything ever again i had this nightmare that i was obsessed with this green Pikachu. that i've never met before <laughs> <laughs> she didn't even put up a good fight she just floated out of a portal doing nothing and also i had a pet squid in my dream yep there's always yeah. a squid <laughs> so now what? Yeah, what am I supposed to do with that? <laughs> and once again, the day is saved. Thanks to... Power Pup! <laughs> I mean, listen, you already... You already completely Pika. us with your day ex machina bullshit. Pika. Just let us go home. Please. Where's Scarlet? We should have attacked him like I said, damn it. <laughs> I should have let you die, monkey. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Actually, I have one more ace up my sleeve. Uh-huh. Remember those Pokemon you wanted me to kill, Monkey? One of them survived, and it's here right now. It's I gonna, don't care. gonna <laughs> save the day. It's an Ultra Beast, a Blasphalon. It's gonna destroy <laughs> everyone. Can you be blasting off again like what? Team Rocket? Just can disappear into the into the a blinking <laughs> sky. Scarlet. <laughs> Scarlet is. Scarlet's still upstairs. I don't know. She's doing some weird hocus pocus. Hocus pocus. Uh-huh. I don't like, I don't like black, there's bad juju afoot. Yeah, maybe, I don't know, she seemed nice enough, but I highly doubt it's too bad. Uh-huh. All right. Oh, no, Scarlet's fine. She's, I'm sure she's Can I ask it. Squid to just, like, slash my throat so I'm dead? <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> oh, no. Felix on top of us. You said enough of this cruel world. Just Pikachu. kill me, man. I'm so done. Akimoto, no, just. I can't go back to prison. Akimoto <laughs> just kind of <laughs> <laughs> looks to the two of you. And says, uh, and says to the party, um, we we never actually really liked them anyway. We just, if you want to send them back to the nightmare timeline, I think they'll be safe there. They can't do a lot of damage. 
They'll be safe in the nightmare timeline. <laughs> well, is the nightmare timeline to us? <laughs> they'll at least not oh. not uh, you know that I, I didn't uh, I didn't word myself properly. You kind of caught Akamoto in a loss for words. <laughs> he just shrugs and says, "That's a good way to get rid of him." Well, as long as he doesn't kill him. All right. Well, they're already tied up, so I guess yeah. ship him. You got a stamp. <laughs> you guys can head into the other room and just ship him off if you want. <laughs> yeah, all right. If uh, I think we will do that. I th um, <laughs> Monkey, Burger, and Squid, do you have any last words before you are teleported off into the nightmare timeline? Never to be seen again by our heroes. When I get there, I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> Well spoken, gentlemen. You are taken into the teleporter and you are shipped off to the nightmare timeline. Thank you, Monkey, Squid, and Burger, for joining us. I, you guys, all uh, step past the teleporter, head upstairs, and you are uh, about to see this. Up top, Esme, Watashi, Scarlet, Crystal, and Professor Puce. You see Ultra Necrozma be taken aback by the appearance of your leader. You do know what your leader looks like. Uh, she is in the pamphlets and she's just kind of standing there. <laughs> she's in the pamphlets! <laughs> well, <laughs> Lavi's Lavi actually picked one up while he was walking. He's reading yeah, like the they take it out and just go like, huh? <laughs> huh? What? Luna, there's a crossword in here. <laughs> up is another, it is four up, four down, Another word for ouch. All right. So how do you react to this? She is currently just kind of floating there, just holding something in her hand. I don't even know what's happening anymore. <laughs> what is it? Is it obvious what she's holding? It looks like what a long tooth. How did you get out there? She begins to float slowly back as from... What you guys know, Sarah is a human. At least that is what team the most people in Team Vision believe. Scarlet knows she is a Celebi, though, or at least mm. kind of like a Celebi. Yeah, that, that, that's that's why been, I kind of want to get. She's been missing. She has been missing for a while. There is a group called Team Peasant Poppers that knocked her into a portal, out oh, into ran random that. random BFE, and she's and been now lost. we're back. <laughs> Wait, was that when they caught the self? Yep. Oh yeah. my god, that was so long ago. <laughs> she has been missing since then. Jesus Christ! <laughs> yeah, because Nightmare Timeline Cena, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah, but I didn't realize they were the reason she was gone this long. <laughs> so, do you need any more info? Do you need any more exposition on her? Um, no. I think I'm good. Okay. She just approaches and just fl slowly floats back. And as she gets closer, Esme, you recognize in her hand is a horn. It is a broken off horn of a pincer. Oh. How did you get that? She oh. looks at oh. you, uh, lifts her head a little, and says, from the future. <laughs> oh, like me. I'm from the future. Correct. <laughs> well done. Well done. Me too. She <laughs> chucks the horn in her chest. <laughs> she just kind of, she kind of looks at the two of you and says, so you're, you two are from Team Vision. I remember pulling you out of the Nightmare Timeline. Oh, I don't really remember. I don't remember a lot of what happened back then, but I suppose so. <laughs> Best and the brightest you got right here. She says you, you mixed up your medicine at the time. That makes sense. And she just kind of like wobbles and woozes a little bit. And she hands Esme the horn and says, can you hold this for me? Of course. Uh, she drops it in your hand and the horn turns into a stone. And she it's just... It's a rock? It's a rock. She, she sits down like just exhausted and says, you would not believe the week I've had. It's been nuts. You wouldn't believe the week we've had. She says, really, why don't you, why don't you tell me about it? Okay, let's sit down and have a chat. Tell me about what you've been through. <laughs> <laughs> what? She thinks for a moment and says, well, I... What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> I got knocked, I got knocked into time and space. She thinks for a moment and she says, well, it's, I've been knocked into time and space and uh, I've been fighting this monster the entire time. And I won! She just waves her hands, just exhausted. Do you mean that one up there floating, or...? She looks around and says, 
No, not that. How? Whoa. Okay, she stands up all of a sudden, looks around as if she's now just seeing everyone for the first time. Uh, she sees Layla and just floats out in the air and says, what's happened here? And she holds out a hand, tries to grip the two of you into a psychic grip. And that's when the rest of Team Fresh Floof appears from the bottom. Okay. You All guys right. step upstairs and Akamoto looks surprised and he, he shouts, Leader Sarah! And he, sh he throws an object at her, like just instinctively. Uh, like if, a weapon or? It is a small, tiny crystal. Uh, no. Uh, roll, <laughs> I don't know what that means. Roll a d20 if you want to try to intercept it. Uh, yeah, I'm going to roll one d20. Any, any, pl any pluses or just one d20? Let's say plus four. Uh, uh. Yeah, Bendy will yeah. try. <laughs> Benji got a 19. What does okay. that do? <laughs> <laughs> you. All right. He you throws grab it. His wrist. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you grab his wrist before he throws it, and you pull out a crystal uh, from his hand, and he's trying to get away, but Venti has just a steel like grip. <laughs> I just, I just like toss it in my hand a couple of times. Okay. I'm not going to lie. I'm very confused. There's a lot of new <laughs> people here and a lot of cosplay. And I'm very confused. What does this crystal do? Who is that? And where the hell is Cosmog? <laughs> oh, there he is. Hi, Cosmog. Okay, answer the other questions. Lavi's like, it's not cosplay. It's a mystical tr martial art transformation. No, Blame, that's cosplay. I'll accept it. Very, very much cosplay. It's cosplay. It's just got magic around it. All right, that's answered. <laughs> what is this? All right, you pull it out, and yes, uh, Venti is holding a burst crystal, and he's just kind of flipping it casually in his hand. Who currently has the Master Ball, by the way? Me. I'm sorry, we have it together. <laughs> you need another Master Ball, okay. Yeah, we have two. Jay still has the one we made, doesn't she? Yeah. yeah. Mine has the, yeah. All right. Yeah. What if Venti crushed it in his hands? <laughs> You can try it, actually. 19. Oh, God. Um, all right, I don't have this thing rolled. This sounds like it's probably a problem for everyone. And at this point in time, I'm really fed up with Team Vision. I, I thought we had a good, like... I mean, problems. Yeah, what the hell? I thought we were trying to be the good guys here, but, like, I have nonstop seen bad things happen because of us all right i want a future where things just kind of work out all right i don't want to deal with more people getting killed because we take the easy route okay enough is enough amen <laughs> as you're, you're you're saying that as the crystal is crushing in your hands and akamoto's like no seriously stop doing that you're not you don't have any idea what you're doing um, oh, what? Oh, th 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 this, this one? This right? This one right here? <laughs> Layla wakes I, up and says, "Oh, sweet God!" <laughs> I got bad news. Steel's super effective against rock. <laughs> yes. <And I> just <laughs> give me a second. <laughs> Everything explodes. Oh, my God. time ends. The end. <laughs> All right. If it saves everyone on this ship. <laughs> oh, it so won't. But it's awesome. Uh, oh, no. It's what they wanted me to do. It's what Fresh Bloop wanted, so I'm trying to help them out. They're my new buddies because they're not killing people. Yes, thank you. We've been trying to tell people that. Oh, my God. Okay, hey. so... Oh, Jesus Christ! Out from the burst crystal emerges Primal Dialga. That's right. Ben, you want to burst... that? That was a terrible idea! I forgot burst crystals... <laughs> Hone in an actual Pokemon, so we actually released it. Uh, Jade, get Hoopa to make a hole, please. <laughs> <laughs> Ultra Necrozma is knocked back from this thing's might, and everything slows down as it just reach. It looks down a little bit, re uh, leans its face forward. It's Sarah. <laughs> it looks at Sarah, and it says.
and in an instant, Sarah is blasted out of existence. Oh. Wow. Whoa. I'm actually okay with that. <laughs> oh!